To a developing story from Detroit's east side where police are searching for the driver who injured one of their own. Yeah, another crash here. It happened late last night. The officer and her partner were just leaving the 11th precinct when their SUV was struck by another car. And then that driver did not wait around, drove off and then took off on foot. Let's get to Nick Monticelli joining us now live with how those officers are doing this morning and who they may be looking for. Rhonda, you know, I don't know if they know who they're looking for. That's part of the problem. But as far as the officers go, both of them are expected to be okay. Both were taken to the hospital. One is a precaution. One, because she probably has a broken arm. And why? Take a look behind me. That is the SUV that they were in that was T-boned yesterday as they were leaving this parking lot, the 11th Precinct, again, on Detroit's east side, which is pretty close to 7 Mile and Ryan. Take a look at this video. This happened at about 1130 last night. Again, they were leaving. You could hear the sirens. You can hear what a tense situation it was when they were T-boned by that driver. Again, the female officer, the driver, had to be cut out of the SUV using the jaws of life. And when you see the damage, you understand why. Not a terrible accident, but obviously the door was smashed and they couldn't open that. And again, she likely has a broken arm. She was taken to the hospital, as was her male partner, just as a precaution. The driver, though, as mentioned, took off. So he was driving this Chevy car, went about a block and a half, and then parked the car, jumped out, and ran away. MSP troopers were called and canines were called and everybody was here trying to track down that driver. Unfortunately, though, they were unable to do so. So now they are certainly trying to figure out who this is and how they can track down that uh, that female or male driver of that vehicle. And again, most importantly, though, Everett and Rhonda, the officers inside of that SUV are going to be OK. We're live here on Detroit's east side. Nick Monticelli, Local 4 News today. Yeah, Nick, thank you.